phone in there. <laughs> and so was that. <laughs> Sunday in sunny Miami. I so said, why not? I always heard about the Florida Keys, so we're going to make a Key Largo today. Let's go. John Cannon, uh, Cannon Hank, Cannon Camp? What am I pronouncing this? Coral State Reef Park? All right. Penna Camp, yes, John Penna Camp, Coral Reef State Park, Key Largo, Florida. All right, we're here. All right, one person, 450, two people. Hi there, just one person? 450, right? 450 for one. Yes, thank you. So you close at 815 today? 8 o'clock. Okay. That's every day though, right? 815 tonight. Alright. Okay, thank you. There you go, thank you. Is parking free in there? Parking? It's free? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay, seems like there's a lot to do here. Let's park over here. All right, I'm just taking a walk. I see there's a beach right there. People got the umbrellas out and everything popping. Crocodilians, wow. Do not sing with crocodilians. No, I had no intention to do that. All right, yeah, no dogs, obviously. It would get eaten by a crocodile quick, so. All right, snorkel. Glass bottom. Okay, kayak. Kayak, I don't have to string set. Kayak takes a lot of energy. I don't have that. The energy to do that in this heat. If I had another person with me, I'd probably do that. You know? But then they have to be in shape as well, right? Okay, that's, I guess this is where you can rent the kayak or whatnot, all right? The life jacket, all that. How much does it rent a kayak? 35, two hours? Cool. 
So, um, people over there are going. I wonder which way over there. How do you get there? Hmm. Probably just more kayak rentals. No diver, no. Well, of course not. It would, it would, it's too shallow to dive. I don't know. I guess I have to put these signs because people do stupid things anyways. I don't know what's down there. I have to drive. Well, good thing I parked close to this. The car is close to the, to the water. I could just take a dip, lock myself up. It's Cannon Beach. Is that what it, the thing said? Yeah. This is rare that I come to a beach and it's not windy. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, for a decent swim, I'm gonna go drive down to the other part, the drawbridge. The lady, the girl who works here told me there's another beach, not as crowded, but smaller though, right? And the good thing about Florida, with your wet towel and shorts and everything, you can just leave in the car, it's so fucking hot, I'll just dry off quick by itself, so I'm gonna make a move down there. Definitely a lot more peaceful. All right, restroom station. Okay, so she said this is a mangrove area. This is why not, we're not seeing the, the nice blue water that that you think of when you're here at Florida Keys. You have to take a boat, snorkeling, or glass bottom tour to get to that. All right, all right. 
All right, next part I'm gonna venture out to is Isla Morada, village in Florida. And that is about 34 minutes from here. All right, Isla Morada, let's go. Again, I'm just randomly driving around the Island Marada. I don't even know what's up here. All right, short little detour. All right, so the next spot I'm gonna check out is uh, Robbie's or something like that. You can feed like tarpons, fish, stuff like that. It's a pretty good tourist attraction. So this is like some uh, beach from the hotel spa thing. You know what I'm nice and quiet. About 40 bucks for a surfboard sign. Tarp on feeding, we'll hit that soon. I have to get a drink and sit down. Look at that. You can see the, the US one, the bridge up there, boats coming in. Yeah. Survive. A la Morada, Florida. I can't go over there. There's nothing there. Man. It's live, so oh shit, you see that?
Manatees, small charts, trust flow. Thank you, sir. All right, so to feed the tarpons. Oh, wow, look at them. I'll show you right now. To feed the tarpons, you got to pay $10 for the bait. <laughs> Aren't you worried about your hand getting bit now? No. Oh, no? Okay, okay. They just have like sandpaper mouth. All right, all right. But then it's a long ride back. I haven't had anything to eat. That's another thing. Why don't you get something to eat? I fucking eat. Start to drink. You know what I'm saying? Why well, just wait till I get back to Miami to get something to eat? Andrew. I don't know. Decisions, decisions. All right. So it's five dollars a bucket to feed the fish. I thought it was someone said it was ten dollars. Uh, it's two dollars fifty cents per person to go in. For yeah. Entry, so it's probably their entrance fees, and then five dollars for each bucket. Okay. Okay. Let me. Th what kind of fish are they? Yeah. This is what the bucket looks like. It's gonna be thread fin herring. They actually yeah. get their name from this back fin here. It looks like a needle. In okay. Bed. Okay. All right. Okay. So what time are you guys close at? Nine o'clock. Okay. All right. Thank you. So lots to do here. Snorkeling, you could you could feed the fish with the bait fish. Sit down, have a drink. It's nice. And so was that. <laughs> All right, so that was Robbie's tarpon feeding, but it's a whole bunch of this stuff. Like the market, I just saw souvenirs, a few bars, restaurants, and shit. It was taco. And this little this drink right here. This drink right here was five dollars, huh? So you already know it's a tourist place, and they're gonna charge it up the ass for stuff. The Corona was eight dollars. I said, "Fuck that." Let me just get back to MIA right now. I need food. I haven't eaten today. All right, MIA on the way. <laughs> 